Good morning everyone, it's Beck here from Hello My Name Is Beck popping in today to show you a haul from AliExpress but I'm quickly showing you my nails because I had them done yesterday but how cute are they with the little penguin? Eek. Anyway, uh, sorry, I will start by showing you some things that I got recently from AliExpress um, so I've got five different shops I think five different AliExpress shops. So I'll start with the ones that I received first. Now I bought these last year as a advent calendar present for Lizzie, Lizzie Hill. Um, and I just, I kind of just wanted them all year round um, to make little shakers with um, and possibly put some like peppermint. Um, I'll show you, sorry. Like a little peppermint, um, I guess the beads, like little, uh, is it polymer clay beads? Anyway, I got those last year and I just thought I should really make something with those. Um, then I got this one here, it's just um, a, a plain leaf dye, but I've seen some people do some coloured backgrounds with white leaves on the front, so I'm going to give that a go. And then this one here is probably a, a more advanced version of this one because um, it has, sorry, it has the mug, has like the little candy cane that you can layer. Um, you can even layer the whipped cream and you've got some snowflakes for the actual front of the mug if you want to. And um, on the picture it had this as a gingerbread, like um, just hanging off the side. And you get the little cute bow um, and then you've even got these little lights here so I just thought that this was pretty cool in the sense that I'd be able to even use all of these bits um, without like the the hot chocolate mug or yeah I could I can use these all year round and once again one two three three more snowflakes yay <laughs> so that's those um, the other shop that I got, um, now where are those? I'm missing a set, but I'll, I'll show you these. So I've got this little tiny, um, I'll show you my, that's my thumbnail just there. So little tiny, tiny paper clips. These are gold. The other set that's missing, and I don't know where I've put it, are like, um, it's almost like a rusty bronze colour um, so like more vintagey than these and then these ones are my favourite I don't know whether you can see but there's a little cute heart so they're gold and they have a little heart inside the actual paper clip um, so once again that's the size of my thumb so there's those and there's the other pack that's missing somewhere. I don't know where I've put that. I've already started using them. So uh, then the next one I got was just it's a little packet of little succulent stickers, like sticker flakes. Um, I think you can get these for like 90 cents. But yeah, it's just little... They're shiny stickers, so they're just, um, I guess, just decorating envelopes and things like that. So that's those. And then some washies. From the looks of this one here, with the leaves, like autumn leaves, um, I think Annie has this one because I saw it recently on a Happy Mail that she'd made, Lizzie Hill. That's that one. And then this one, I've got this one already, but I loved it that much that I bought another one. Um, I'll open it up so you can see. So it's basically on the one, the one side of the actual washi. So it's on the base. There you go. Ta-da! Yeah, so I already have this one, but I went back. Um, to buy it again when I realised how much I loved it and then this one if there you go this one's just all yellow flowers I thought it's kind of spring like that's that one so cute I think
think the washi tapes were only one ninety nine each, um, which would probably be only a pound in the UK. So very, very cool. Um, which one to show you first? Now, so these are big hauls, these ones from AliExpress, but I absolutely love these stamp sets. Um, and unfortunately, AliExpress has an ability to um, rip off other shops and designers. Um, but for people like me who absolutely love the American brands like um, Simon Says Stamp, um, but you don't want to pay $25 for one set. And also then you have to pay um, shipping on, on top of that. And then you have to also pay... I think it's a tax that they add at the end. Um, so I worked out that this bundle here would have cost me $250. I actually went on to Simon Says Stamp and I put all of this in my basket and it would have been $250. So AliExpress has this set for $5 and it's free shipping. So can you argue with that? I know that I know, I know, I know, I know that I'm not supporting the actual smaller company, Simon Says Stamp. And there's even ones in here that are from Pink Press Studio, I think. Um, so yes, I apologize from the bottom of my heart, but when I can get the same thing for $5 instead of 30, yeah, well, I'm gonna do it. I'm sorry, 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 but good. Look at these penguins. Look. So cute. So yes, I know that AliExpress has ripped off these designs, but North Pole Express delivery, how cool is that on an envelope? And then you even have, I should probably try and get a, a white piece of paper for you guys. Hang on. There you go, white cardstock. Look, even on an envelope, how cute would that be with the address above? Here comes Santa, sleigh bells ring, are you listening? Oh, I feel so guilty that I haven't bought these from the real shop. But if AliExpress has them for $5, and I think they're even like $4, um, they're under $5 is what I should be saying. So... Um, this one here is one that I did not order. I actually ordered it was a script. Um, it was literally the most beautiful script all the way down um, this 6x6 six six square. Um, uh, so AliExpress have, uh, I guess, substituted this one. So hopefully I'll get the opportunity to say thank you to somebody and make a card with this one. I'm sure I will. This is so cute. Look, um, once again, Simon Says Stamp. Um, thank you, sweet friend. You are the thread that keeps us together. Each stitch on this card is a hug from me. So glad to be your friend. And I've got um, I've got some dies that have holes in so I can stitch. So I think that that's a really, really cute one. I love the, the hellos. This one again, I've got the um, it's the embroidery. It's a round one with the the holes in, so I can I can stitch hearts and things like that. But I can then also use it. Um, it's an embroidery hoop, and I could stamp in the centre with with these letters because they are like cross stitch letters. Cute. Once again, something like three dollars. Oh, this is a beautiful one. Look, so she's she's stood in the rain, but you look fabulous even when it's raining. After the storm comes the rainbow. This one here, don't lose hope, brighter days are coming. I'm here for you, rain or shine. Follow the rainbows. You are my rainbow every single day. For sharing, uh, So you can actually then team it up with thank you for sharing me with kindness. How gorgeous is that? Um, and this image I could, if I wanted to, stamp it and then watercolour on here. 
make it some some sort of uh, mixed media watercolor i love it i love it friend i miss you thinking of you beautiful cuteness look okay so we've got snowman snowman he's holding a card cute 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 once again 24.99 on simon says stamp i'm so so sorry but i'm not <laughs> sorry not sorry this one's actually a really recent one this one's been designed by christina werner she actually did a video of, of these two cats she watercolored them but i thought that this is so cute all i want it for christmas is to be near to you then you've even got meowy christmas happy holidays i like the script on that one sending holiday smiles cute yeah Oh, this one's adorable. I love otters, um, and Charlie loves otters as well, so I had to buy this one. I might have to make him, him a card. You are utterly amazing. I utterly adore you. <laughs> oh, how could you say no if you saw that on AliExpress when you know that this is, like, very expensive elsewhere? This one here, it's um, just a stencil full of stars. Love, love, love. I have a texture paste, which is actually a um, clear gloss. So I could use that on top of um, some of my Distress Oxides. Or even if I wanted to, I could um, do my Distress Oxides and then spray this with water over the top because the Distress Oxides actually... Um, I change change the the look so stars pretty oh i think you guys are gonna love this one how good would this be for watercoloring it's quite big um so all of these flowers and it says you are so beautiful i think i have a person in mind for this and i think she would love it if i did some watercolors or even some some inking Eesh. and then this one i saw this last year from simon says stamp somebody did a video where they did um, distress oxides they blended the background and literally all they did was stamped these in black on the card it was a square card and just at the bottom and they made it look like um the distress distress oxides they had um inks across um which were like oranges and yellows and it looked like a sunset background oh to die for and i've already stamped with some of these and they're the same same quality same same quality so i apologize for my greediness but hey now so then the next store um, once again, Simon Says Stamp Stuff, um, designed by Christina Warner, Werner. These are her snowflakes that she does. Now these snowflakes, um, if you buy these on Simon Says Stamp, they're about $20 each. This one's probably about $15. This one's $20. These two, this one was a dollar, some like dollar fifty, and I think this one was two dollars. So these two snowflakes, she's actually named um, Sophie and Daf Daphne, and these are her cats. Um, so each year she designs new snowflakes, um, and these are the snowflakes she's actually designed. Um, all of them here. I actually have this one here. Um, I showed you the other day in the the video I had. Um, and I think I've got another one for the, this one here. Can you see just, just the spike, spiky one under here? Um, yes, yeah, so she designs one each year and she names her snowflakes after people she knows. Um, but this year she's named her Sophie and Daphne and that's her two grey hair, like their short hair American uh, cats. 
the American breed short hairs and so those are the snowflakes and I'm in love with them already so then she's designed this stamp here now it's actually um, if you I don't know whether you can see but it's actually an inverted stamp so the snowflakes don't stamp it's actually the background that does so I actually have a it's a brayer coming so I can actually brayer the actual background and stamp this so hopefully I'll get to play with that I know that we're almost near Christmas and out of it but so that's that one then this one here it's just a little ho-ho and um, I've seen a card with this one where they've repeated ho 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 all the way down which is cute then this one here is merry and bright and people have been making shaker cards with this one and just doing the whole thing on the front um, and putting sequins behind these letters so I think that's very cute okay so um, oh I did find those little bronzy ones so like vintagey bronzy bronzy paper clips and then last from aliexpress are so it was a different shop um are these i bought some buttons and i bought some embroidery hoops with the the love on and they're just little charms that i can use or gift so that's cute and then this one here is not from aliexpress this one here is from kiki k is it yep kiki k i'll show you the designs so we've got the little sausage dog the cats penguin mittens gingerbread trees so i want to just do a quick flip through of this for you guys and yeah because I think you guys would appreciate this one. So this is Kiki K's Paper Lovers Book. So you've got the trees, you've got the design that's on the front. Hot chocolates, candy canes, gingerbread people and Christmas puddings. So it's some glorious paper. This one here makes a little heart down here with the um, checkerboard. I guess it's like a, just a decoration that you can use. This one here is like a triangular box. I don't know whether you can see that. Some bows. This one here is a rosette. You have to concertina this paper. Little um, little gift bag or envelope. It would be like a little policy envelope. A little gift box. Another gift box. Um, door hangers. This one here's a bunting, some pop out cats that you can actually just use on the front of cards. These are all tags, some more tags with gold. This one here is a bonbon gift box. For those of you in the UK, a bonbon is a cracker. This one here, the red is um, slightly brighter than what it's showing there. This this red is deeper, whereas up in the camera it's looking quite orangey. But how cute are those little doggies? Little sausage dogs. So then we've got tree, a tree that you can put together, or several trees that you can put together. These are cards that you can just pop out. More cards. Those two there. Stickers. Stickers. Alphas. Um, some more paper. Another rosette. These are ball balls that you can actually stick together um, to create one ball ball. Um, some, another policy envelope. Some bunting. Oh no, actually I think this creates a reef. Yeah, you see these leaves here. I don't know when you can see them. And then the um, holly holly leaves there. So you actually pop it on this circular thing to create a wreath. Gift box. Another gift box. Some cards. Some uh, tags. This one here does like a hanging 
hanging decoration, some more stickers, um, some more papers. So you've got the cute, cute, cute kitties and the sort of jogs, another rosette. So yeah, that red that you can see up there is very bright and orangey, whereas the red that I have here is more like a, a cherry tomato red, like it's no more of a cherry red, like a deep, deep red. So I don't know why the camera is showing me such a bright red. These are more baubles that you can create. Cute little envelope you can pop out. And then you have um, gift box, gift box, gift box, more tags, cute, 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 cute. Let's porty. Let's see if I can bring that up. So I can... Cute. Some more pop out things, pop out ephemera, I guess. Little, would you tag them? I don't know. Stickers. And then, last but not least, wrapping paper that you can actually tear out of the book. Ta da! Ta da! Ta da! Ta da! So, yes, I treated this, uh, treated myself to this um, because somebody made me look at the website recently and that was just a bit lethal because I was like well I kind of have to have that now hmm. I wonder who that was okie dokie thank you so much for popping in today to have a look at my little haul I will be back um, this weekend to announce the winner to my giveaway from my last um, my last video um, so it was a hidden giveaway so if you haven't entered already go back and watch that video so that you can comment the right thing okie dokie I will catch you later hope everyone is having a nice time at the moment um, I know that there is lots and lots of things going on in this world um, but remember we just have to spread kindness love and um, just be there for each other and I'm here for you guys if you ever need to chat. Thank you so much guys, take care, lots of crafty love and I will see you in my next one. Bye!